Thick, 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 thick. Thick Nickelodeon. Ah. What is up, everybody? Welcome back to my channel. My name is Cece. In today's lookbook, y'all, I'm just going to be bringing y'all something cute and simple. Definitely, I would say more leaning towards the i want to say artsy style new york fashion week inspired type of look but right so yeah anyways <laughs> thank you guys for joining me today uh hopefully y'all can stay to the end i would really freaking appreciate it and i would also appreciate if y'all would go ahead and leave a like and a comment and you know show some love subscribe join the team you know all the use and stuff like that things that are free but definitely help the channel grow okay weird so thank you help you girl out <laughs> and i'm gonna catch y'all in a bit okay let, let's let's i'm sorry yeah, no, I smoked the ganja. Okay. <laughs> okay, we all know that New York Fashion Week is definitely past and things like that, but I am very late to the every party girl, so <laughs> yeah. Anyways, this outfit was definitely, I feel like, would be inspired. Like, if I was to go to New York Fashion Week, these are some items that I would most likely bring, depending on the occasion of the event. Yeah, basically. I, th these are the items that I would probably probably pick, but y'all know I'm good for a switch up, so it don't matter. But yeah, anyway. And to keep things short, I always just simplify things. So pants are Shein, top is Sorella, and then this belt that I was finally able to fit that I got from Shein like years ago. And girl, I had lost so much weight, and I didn't realize it. And now I'm able to fit it like a glove, baby. Like I'm just sliding into everything. I feel good. Like. This is the best I felt in the minutes, so I'm good. Yeah, we doing good. <laughs> Outfit number two. Thank y'all so much for you know staying through outfit number one. I know that the intros are probably our hardest times here. Whatever. <laughs> okay. So, anyways, outfit number two is definitely like i feel new york and stuff inspired i i definitely have some lola brook inspiration here and i'm i'm really feeling it each okay like i'm don't cuss too early now but i'm really feeling it girl. like it's so cute um so if y'all are on my instagram y'all see that i shared this outfit on my story and i asked y'all what shoes to go with and i had chose um there was either like some black side slides or some black or some black slides or some <laughs> uh brown steve madden slides and well the black and the brown was like girl they was tying each other up but anyway so my boyfriend was like why don't you just wear the heels wear these ones and i'm like all right so i tried it and so yeah this is his influence at the bottom or whatever so i went with heels and i kind of like it you know it elevates the outfit it could have been very chill or whatever but you know that's the beauty of it make sure y'all follow me on instagram and stuff to get behind the scenes and things like that keeping it simple we got shein on the shoes the shorts are sorella the top is shein and so is the belt and then the hat i want to say is in, uh, not i think it's amazon or aliexpress for one of the two and then but the, the the necklace though definitely aliexpress and then the bag is shein okay <laughs> I'm always gonna come through with a creation of my own because as a designer, like I just feel very odd leaving my own things out and leaving my subject to just blindness when it comes to these good as items that I be bringing on Instagram and on my other social media platforms that you should also definitely join me on. Okay, a little bit of capitalism there, whatever. Anyways, <laughs> this outfit, this okay, so the top took me a while to make and i kept going in and out and out about the design about how i wanted it and how i wanted it to come out but yeah it ended up coming out as a what i like to describe as a clusterfuck okay yes <laughs> um it came out cute though when i wear it like it's so freaking cute so this is my first time styling it i love the way i styled it i love like the patchwork and things that i did on it and yeah it's it's to die for look that's the only like when it comes to my things oh i'm gonna get descriptive baby period okay because got it <laughs> period <laughs> okay <laughs> the shoes she in duh and these spanks girl probably some dick sporting goods like girl i i have spanks from when i did basketball in like eighth grade and i could still fit on y'all so spanks they never really retired i mean right <laughs> okay the purse is uh girl she in whatever Ugh. i'd be so tired of saying that shit okay 
look, I'm going to find a way. I'm going to find a way to be transparent with y'all, and I, I do be trying to say stuff. So, I'm definitely going to branch out and find different stores and stuff to shop shop at. But, yeah. Girl, currently, right now, I, I got bigger fish to fry. All right? So, yeah. I'm going gonna, I'm gonna to get into this patchwork, though, because I thought that was really cute. And what I added to the... It's like an eyeball, but it's like a heart thing. It didn't come out, like, really as vibrant as I like, but whatever. I hope it was cute. Moving on to, girl, what, what number was we on? Hey, boy. <laughs> no, I got that from my radio. <laughs> Moving on to outfit number four, and I'm sorry if, like, the audio quality is kind of trash right now. I'm actually having to record in my living room, and I'm trying to figure out how I wanted to do this, but, uh, girl, whatever, you know, things must get done, whatever. So, oh, outfit number four, pulling out the, gl the, the blickies, okay? Uh, the skirt, y'all, I made it, and that was, like, my first time actually making a successful skirt. So, you know, hats off to you, girl, I did that, it's period. And then, so the top is like a, t a tank top, like, cut out or whatever. And then, you know, I have, like, my little white bra that I love so much or whatever. And, yeah, it made this, and it inspired me to make a design. So, I'm definitely going to have to bring that soon. And then, like, my favorite freaking shoes. Oh, yeah, y'all, and this coach bag that I thrifted from Goodwill. Like, y'all found a coach bag. And she cute. Girl, stop on me. And I turned it into, like, a little hip thing because, like... Girl, why not? Let's let's go. <laughs> I'll be having to keep it short, sweet, and to the point because by the analytics, it shows that y'all y'all really ain't down for y'all. Y'all ain't really as real as y'all say y'all is, but um, the numbers are not number, and how the numbers need to be number and grow. So let the numbers number. I'm just saying. Don't forget to like this video. Period. Okay, y'all. Starting off with this top is a. It was a thrifted top that I had for a while, and I actually um, upcycled it. And I could like when I created it, it was gross, squeezing everything together, right? So now that I'm wearing it in my new body, okay, and she looped in a goose baby, so I had to like nigga rig it. You know what I'm talking about? Yeah. So <laughs> I had to get with it or whatever, and. You know, it came out cute. And then the pants are she in as well. So, you know, all these items I have previously talked about and or maybe even not. I don't know. Some Something may need to be new to you. And if you're new to this channel, girl, everything new to you. So, hey, boo. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> girl, that's how we joke when we shut up. So, top is custom pants are she in. Bag she in. Jewelry, AliExpress, and Sorella. And shoes are AliExpress. Now this outfit right here between this one and the last one girl this outfit right here though this outfit right here though freak me ready period like I just feel like girl this outfit is giving me all type of cult classic tees that I need in my lifetime early 2000s gagging right now period I love it <laughs> I sound like such a Gen Z person whatever girl this outfit was cute and y'all know I love my big old chunky shoes that I got from Shein, girl. And I, I stand by these shoes. Like, y'all know how I feel about fast fashion, which is why I don't really, like, support it as much. And then whenever y'all see my videos, it's always going to be repurposed. Or I show y'all how to restyle something or style whatever. Because it, the whole point is to dismantle fast fashion, period. This this is my whole point. I'm here for that reason. And this reason alone. Okay? But y'all love it so much. I'm going to teach you how to fucking survive with it, okay? And this is how you do that. And I think that this is so freaking bomb. And then the bag, girl, y'all know she in. Like, y'all get y'all dudes, period. And then my sunglasses, y'all. If y'all ever want to know, I be robbing my daddy. I don't know where he be getting these glasses right now, bro. <laughs> my dad's going to stay with a pair of shades. I've never seen my dad without shades, for real, bro. And down to our simplification of the outfit, the top is she in. Shorts, the girl, the, the ex girl, the whole thing. Wait, girl, China. Mm, let her have it. Anyway, moving on to outfit number whatever, girl. Mm -hmm. I told myself I ordered this skirt for a reason. So I took some bomb pictures, and y'all should go like those on Instagram. Run that up for you, girl, okay? Because Instagram is doing this little petty thing where if you ain't posting a while, they ain't really gonna push your content out like that, girl. So they were really showing it to like half of my mother loving people. And girl, I'm literally getting burly half the likes, girl. I'm not even feeling like, what? 
second Ooh. this is anyway. our last look and like the last outfit girl like literally everything is from china herself but she she produced it yes yes she did anyway so other than things that are like locally sourced through you know reasonably places like my jewelry which is usually mostly girl not even mostly girl mo all the time locally sourced and then my bag accessories a lot of the time so my hat is actually a locally sourced thrifted item i do a lot of that and stuff so if y'all need any if y'all so if y'all need if y'all would like more content girl i Hit me up in the community tab. We'll, we'll, we'll meet each other over there. Because uh, I can't even bring it all over here right now. Which y'all attention spans this long. So let's go ahead and wrap this up. Because I don't know how y'all love to go before the video is even out. So with this being the ending of the video, this is where I like to take the time to thank you guys so much for all your support. Because without y'all none of this is possible so like it would really be like i'm doing this for nothing but then again i'm not doing this for nothing because i also like kind of making videos for myself so you're right anyway i'm gonna do it but <laughs> this is fun for me okay it's an outlet of creativity and i'm down and i'm just grateful that y'all really do appreciate it anyway so thank y'all so much for watching these videos um don't forget to like comment subscribe please share these videos you know and things like that i'm gonna catch y'all in my next video next thursday so don't forget to like comment and subscribe follow me on instagram all right bye girl i'm getting hoarse i need to eat i need some tea Hold on. oh yeah stay safe on the streets and keep your head on the swivel mm -hmm. bye I feel a way when I be with you